At dinner time, Cameron's still calling the shots. Cameron, come and sit down and eat your dinner, please. Cameron. Oh. This time, Chris springs into action. You spat mummy. at Mummy. Why do you think Mummy's asked me mummy. to take you to your bedroom? Mum. It's Super Nanny's chance to see discipline dad style. Disgusting boy! How dare you! Typically what we're seeing is Cameron trying to get his parents' attention on a negative level by spitting. And now we'll get banging and kicking. Is this his discipline? Is this, what is this? This is my way of trying to tell him that his behaviour is not acceptable. Right. I would leave him in here until he's calmed down, but it doesn't always work. I'm going for hours. Uh, Cameron, no! <laughs> comes a point where I'm so annoyed with it. I can see angry. You can get me a, a lot angrier than that. Yeah, I feel my blood it. boiling, you know, it's like... Um, there's no reasoning with him. <laughs> but you said that for ages, Cameron, and you're still spitting. I'm just going to go upstairs now and see if I can distract Cameron out of it, because he just, he gets so upset. Are you going to say sorry to Mummy? I'm rather curious. Are you on the same page or not? No. No. He's now getting cuddles and kisses and, yep. oh, that makes everything OK. And it all seems like all the work that I've done to instill that he stays in his room and that he's done wrong and he's not supposed to be doing this has now been washed away. So, to me, what you do doesn't work. I don't that think Chris there's any need to physically drag a four-year-old child into bedroom. I don't think there's any need for a four-year-old child to physically hit and spit his mother, either. No, you're right. You are right. You are right. And do you think I really like the fact that he doesn't respect me? I know you're not a very good mum. I hold my hands up to everything I crap at. And you, you think that everything you do is right. I don't think everything I do is right. You try all these things and when it don't work, you just walk out. No, but that's because you you've already interfered. Out. We'll go. We'll go, for, we'll go for a drive. We'll go. And... go for a drive, you go for a drive. I'll go for a drive to calm go. down, to get myself away from the situation because I feel myself getting so angry and so frustrated and worked up. That you're scared of what? I'm scared of what I'm going to do. Where do you two go right now? Because this now has affected your relationship.